Alright guys, it's Max and I'm feeling comfortable, but not as comfortable as this owner feeling on stock suspension. So what we're going to do is we're going to dial them in with a 3 inch TJM suspension lift. Can't wait, let's get to work. <laughs> Alright guys, in front of me are the TGM components that we're going to install on this vehicle. We have upper control arms and this soft googie, googie, <laughs> rear springs, coilovers, front springs, rear shocks, the whole shebang. We're going to get to it. We have some wheels for that 5th gen 4Runner from Black Rhino. Look at this. Oh, these are the crawlers. They're beautiful. They also come in beadlock and different color. They have this uh, polished aluminum, they have the bronze, and obviously beadlocks, like I said. Alright, guys, in front of us are springs that will go into the coilovers and the rear. These are actually the heavy duty, which if you're putting some heavy load, the front bumper winch, these are perfect for your application. So what we're doing is we're compressing the spring to install the top half because the spring is under load. And this machine makes it so much easier. Once we compress the spring, we can actually install the top nut and tighten it back down. I got my brother Tim here helping us out today. What How's a good one, guys. Hey, I wasn't done. <laughs> <laughs> there he is. After we installed the suspension kit, we took it to ProTec Auto to get the tires mounted, balanced, and do the alignment. When the truck came in, super stock, super boring. When it left our shop, it looks a million dollars better. Guys, I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and any products you saw in this video, also available on our website. Don't forget to check that out. Thank you for watching.